he got a he got a Jordan joint on now, so I, I think he like super mondo or something. Okay. Cat fixes the hair, gets ready. Gotta have the hair right. Uh, I think that's Mondo getting the ball. We'll see. We'll be able to know as soon as we get there on offense. If he, it might be Kiv. It might be It's if normally go, this side, but nope, I'm not quite sure. He went to trip so okay. fast. Mondo okay. Oh, yeah. Mondo, you got you, got you, got you. Yep. So I'm excited. This first play is going to tell me everything I need to know. So what book is Mondo in? He's in the Chargers. He's in Chargers. Okay. That kid's sitting up to 3 5 uh, This first play is everything right here. Some people try to pick up the blitz, some people try to attack it from where it's being blitzed mm -hmm. from. Mm -hmm. So we'll see what type of approach he takes. Right, go. First down, uh, right inside zone up the middle. You see the motion, the motion came from the left. He wants to touch that corner so that he can seal. Mm -hmm. And he has the option to go outside or cut it up like he did. Mm -hmm. His run stick was a little weird right there, though. He like he was real too anxious. He ran right at the center, but. Young Kevin at 335 odd. Flip. Gotta be flipped. Yeah, flip, I think. Mm -hmm. I can't. I, I gotta go see him. See if but usually when that linebacker's like that, I think it's flipped. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's coming up left. Look at B got. Looks real. He just came to the beat. I got a huge, huge sack, third and 15. Oh, third and 15. Okay. Quick. That's what I'm saying. This first, this first possession is everything. Now, I don't know if, you, if, if you've been under a rock for this first month of Madden, but you got to be able to handle that pressure off the end. It's coming Absolutely. pretty fast. you got to be able to block it Screaming on both again. sides. Yeah. 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 It might be a long night, and he's rattled because he had two receivers wide open. That's the problem with formations where the tight end and the running back are on the same side because it's hard to block or max protect both sides. So most of the formations, most of the better players, that's why Trip Bunch is a good formation because they're trying to block that tight end and the running back to the opposite side because most of the pressure is coming from both wings. All right, so that first, that first possession lets you know mm -hmm. Kiv's ready. Mm -hmm. not, 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 not ready, but he's coming at him with pressure. Mm -hmm. Where a little rattled because he had receivers open, he just never hit him. Mm -hmm. So he's, he's, he's staring at the pressure. But it could be a defensive battle. We're going to see where it's at now. So we're going to see how Armando had his He's in dollar. He's probably sending both dual edge. Yeah, yeah pro probably in the. It was his cover. I had to let I go. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm only said three. Three he's shell going, right there. Great oh, defense, Armando. Great defense. Everything was bad. Great defense. I just saw Armando lip saying a bunch of work today. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what he said if I had to bet everything on it. He went coverage that first though. He threw the loop around him, but he still went coverage. Coverage again. Oh, nice so, dot to the running back. back. That's, that's I like that. What you got? Huh? What you got? Huh? So if you're right here, so he's not in field goal range yet. He could play coverage to get him the fourth down. Mm -hmm. You know, concerned like if he was on the other side of the 48, you kind of want to knock him down, knock him back a little bit more so he can't hit a drag or something to be in field goal range. In this situation, I don't know what I would do with Mike Bonner. I'm more of a pressure guy. I mean, I, I, I just, at this point, it's definitely two down territory. I don't, I don't think absolutely. we're not even. And where he is? Absolutely. Yeah, we're not even discussing yeah. anything but two downs. No, it can be fourth and 30, I think he's It's a good defense. Late drag. Late, Ooh, oh, nice spin. He was stopped. That was great defense. He put Devontae Freeman out there for that exact reason. Too. Gotcha. For that exact reason. Yeah, that nice spin move. So right off the catch. I've seen a lot of uh, Freeman at receiver, and I've seen a lot of uh, Coleman at receiver, too, for that. Usually it's called the Coleman spin move ain't, that, ain't as high. Okay. But he does run the ball like straight up like that. Oh. Better than Freeman does for most people. I like Freeman personally because he's real quick and shifty. I like to make real subtle moves. But that's probably the reason he's at on his drag because mm -hmm. he likes to do moves right off the catch. Young kid moving the ball, looking solid. Second and four. Yeah, he's still in, in still in bunch right now. Oh, he's, he's not. He's, yeah, he's, he's not going anywhere. Field goal range, drag. Oh, he dropped it. Third and four coming up. I think he missed his drag across the middle, but mm -hmm. that was going into trouble, so that's probably why he hit that. You see that that first read, it looks like he checked that first, that flat is the first thing you got to check because I think that's the first read for everybody yeah. that comes out yeah. for that mesh is, is, the, is, the, is that quick quick to the uh, sideline flat. Bunch is so frustrating. Mm -hmm. Just talked it up. Yeah, <laughs> That's the first read for Bunch right there. Name, I got to go play yep. Bunch Sweet. Go ahead, get your, get your game uh, in, man. Thanks I, a lot. Hopefully, I don't see y'all again. All right, all right. Got my man Joe coming hey, to give us a little help Tuesday, here. Tuesday, 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 Tuesday. Hey, go. First and 10. Picks up the blitz. 
Nice pass. Nice pass right there. Chat. All right, so what are we looking at? Let's see. First down and goal at the six-yard line. goal, yeah. He already got a stop. Yeah, he's looking pretty good right here. Solid drive right here. Honestly, in this situation, I would I would just put on two clock immediately. I mean, just because every second counts in this type of matter. You know what I mean? Even if you're not even trying to keep clock over it. There's no point of hiking that ball at 15. What's the difference about hiking that ball at 15 or hiking that ball at at what? Zero. Yeah. You know what I mean, it's just yeah. a few seconds off the clock for your opponent. He's already gotten a stop. I'd take as much time off the clock as we possibly can. Black Phoenix went all day. Overpower. What's up? What's up? What's up? My, chat. My phone at 100 today, so we good. What's up, Air Dan? Motion right. Verticals. Good play. Good strip by Manu right there. He didn't yeah. go for the tackle because he thought. There could be a chance he possession caught that, mm -hmm. and he just went for the. You know, yeah, he that, was, that was a nice underneath. That, that might have been his, his third check down. I thought that he was looking for that high pass in the middle, so that was probably his third his third read. So, yeah, that, you're right. Mm -hmm. Reprogression. He mm -hmm. went straight to A probably mm -hmm. looking yeah. for that curl, like you said. Looking to see is that try to curl for the high point to draw the defense. Yep. Exactly, and that's what a lot of people are doing in the red zone, especially mm -hmm. with the Falcons, mm -hmm. because of Julio. He's a big body. He's probably going to be on motion verticals, maybe out to Julio right here on the third down. Look, he's on the wheel route here. Mato playing great defense. Oh. Left the running back open. Tevin right. doesn't fight. And question is, do you go for this? I go for this. Every time? Right now. You got the stop. I go for this. So you're going to test your you're going to test you're, play, the I, the you're playing with the house's money right now. I'm going for this. Worst case scenario, you put your man at what, the, the one yard line? You put, him, you put him at the inch yard line. And then you got to make him go 99. And I don't think too many Madden players really this have that nine, especially in this Madden with that type of blitz, mm -hmm. to go 99. So, yeah, I would go. It's, it's no way I, I kick this field. Right? Yeah, never ever. So, what are we doing right now? I, I, I'm, if, he, if he comes all the way in, I'm thinking for the toss. Yeah, I always look toss first. Yeah, yeah. Toss left, too. I'm thinking for the toss. Literally toss left. Yep. Here we go. Call it out. Yep. Cuts back inside. Oh, no, sir. That's still Good D. Bang! That man got no stick. Ooh, that was bad stick. He had that. Wide open touchdown. The fuck you thought this was? Goofy? We got to keep it PG my for, my for, my for my the people. My stuff. My <laughs> now the only thing is he has to drive. Ooh. I don't like that call. Ooh. It's too conservative. Ooh. It's too conservative. Motioning in a receiver. It was conservative and it was still dangerous. He almost got blown up in the backfield right there. Yeah, I'm not running that. I mean, I just I would rather pass four straight times mm -hmm. and just pray mm -hmm. that I can get a drag or two mm -hmm. and maybe make a spin. Have you ever seen a holding call down here for a safety? Yes. Have you? I've never seen. I've it, seen so. an intentional grounding. Knock on wood. I'm not trying to touch it. I'm not trying to talk it up. But, I've uh, had intentional grounding too, uh -huh. which is so bad. You know what I mean? Like taking it yourself. Uh, dot. Right nice there, crossing you route. Got to hold on. And there's that R1 button. Oh, man, that strip button. You saw Manu use it. Mm -hmm. and now you see Kiv use it. Mm -hmm. If you guys didn't know in the chat, RB strips the ball out all the time. Strip fumbles are wild this year. But even strip incompletions, as you can see, twice mm -hmm. already they play good defense on wide open passes. I feel like. Gotcha. Now, this is a big down right here. It's definitely a punt right here if he doesn't get this first down. I, I don't think, he, I don't now, think he's going to Now, the thing down. about it is, with this punt, oh. Manu is going to be feeling so 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 mad i know mm -hmm. how manu is i lie with him all the time mm -hmm. he's gonna get stopped twice he's gonna have to punt given midfield but the thing that hurts so much is just punting twice versus kiv gotcha you know what i mean it just mm -hmm. you, you don't want to play someone that's good that carries a name like kiv you know in the back of your mind it, you, you know it, let's be real madden players will sit here and, and lie to you oh good spin when you see a bracket and you see joe Schmo or whatever the guy's name is you know Punting twice isn't going to really matter to you. Mm -hmm. But when you Playing see the Kiv, top player, yeah. yeah, that's just going to put pressure yeah. on you. You know, I'm punting twice. I, what am I going to do now? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So now it's just, I don't know. We'll see right here. Well, using that thinking, do you? Well, we, we both said we were going to go for it on that fourth down, but using that logic that you're talking about, playing against young kid, does another player take that field goal instead of going for it right there in that, that, that last instance? You know, I think if you're uh, nice truck stick on the sideline, quick I, dot. I think if you're not playing Manu, you, you, you would take your three. Mm. And I know it sounds kind of weird, you know, because like you think Manu, okay, when, you're playing a, mm -hmm. when you're playing a random, mm -hmm. you're thinking, okay, I'm gonna go for it even more here. Mm -hmm. But first, a random, you never know. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't like playing randoms at tournaments because they run a lot. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hello. Nice hit stick. Hello. Running back on the fade out the backfield. Guys like to rely on Tevin Coleman a lot. Mm -hmm. 
and I like it because okay. I mean he's just not going to catch the football that much in traffic. Gotcha. You know what I mean? A lot of head sticks. He's vulnerable to strips like we saw earlier. I think his catching is a little lower than Freeman's too. Yeah, I don't yeah. know. That's why he has Freeman. Yeah, at, at yeah. The, but I seen a lot of people with Coleman at the receiver, but Freeman actually has a little higher catch. He's looking for the guard. He's looking for the guard. There you go. You know, it's hard to know. Awful spin right there. I mean, literally wide open touchdown. He spins for no reason, gets tackled. I mean. Madden dudes, to me, I feel like just try to do too much. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, there's certain moments when you can stick, and there's certain moments when you're not going to... I think know? that's the thing. I mean, a lot of people have things in their thoughts choreographed, you know what I mean? Instead of instead of dealing and reacting, they choreograph, already have their mind made up for some reads, some passes. And you know, it's the same thing with their offense. He's going to throw it right there again, another drag, he spins immediately. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He's trying to make somebody miss. But I mean, literally, he dumps the drag. Mm -hmm. He has a 93-speed receiver versus Deion Jones. Like, why are you spinning back when mm -hmm. you literally can just keep running? Second and five. <laughs> coming out again. Kiv in a bunch. Draw play blown up. Loss He's, of two right there. Kiv is in a bag. It's just Manu's in a bigger bag. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's like Kiv's in a giant grocery bag, but Manu's in a re reusable. Someone has to get out of it at some point. Well, at least Kiv picked up his bag in scoring position. So even if he doesn't get this first down here, he is in scoring position for playing great defense. In big game, uh, Larry, if you guys didn't know, Larry, uh, the Bucks GG. He just, he's in the game of spot me right now. Bag again by Manu. Manu was wow. playing beautiful defense. I Did mean, that sack take No, he's still in field goal range. Okay, I, I was I was saying that that sack took him out of field goal range. The thing, the thing about Matt Bryant that's so good, he can hit from 40. Uh, that's another thing about the Falcons. They have literally no weaknesses anywhere. Mm -hmm. I mean, their O-line is good. Their quarterback, Matt Ryan, young kids, is good uh -huh. for Madden. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I mean... You have great receivers everywhere, two good running backs. You have a good enough D-line, mm -hmm. fast secondary. I mean, and then you have a good kicker. Like, where, where is – So, what we got going over there in that game right there? It's an overtime game? What we got? Yeah. We so got Spot Me and – Larry Larry Smurda, mm -hmm. uh, pro player for G, uh, Bucks GG versus Did he Spot just get a stop in overtime? Nah, he kicked his three. Oh, he kicked his three. Okay. And now Spot Me's on his game-winning drive. He tossed out right there. He gets bagged in the back. Okay, right okay. We'll, we'll keep you. We'll try to keep you guys updated with some of the scores that are going on in this first round. And again, you see Manu going to go ahead and throw that out. He knew he was manned up right there, mm -hmm. but threw it just one step too late. Got you. So uh, second down to ten. In this other game, we have a second down to eleven. Uh, spot me at the nineteen yard line. Okay. So, spot me no matter where is going to take his three probably. Gotcha. Long, you Got know, you. He's in field goal. So spot me. Spot me's down in overtime. Three, yeah. Thirteen ten. Okay. Yeah. And I mean, that means Larry probably is going to have a game when he's driving him. Kid's going to send the blitz again. Manu blocking it real well. Missing his reads, though. And this is not the Manu that I've seen play. I've played this dude a billion times. Okay, okay. And the reason why I don't play him anymore is because it's annoying to play him. He makes okay. his reads always online. And, and Larry with the, what is that, pick for the game? It's a pick for the game. Larry beats pick? Spot Me. Okay, Spot Me goes down. Overtime 13 to 10. We'll try to get some more scores for you guys soon. Good, I mean, good play by Manu right there. Puts the running back on a route right there. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. and quick dot to the, well, nice, nice curl. He put him on a curl route, I believe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I mean, and, and I know Manu was known. I know some of the chat know him. Man 15, man 16, four mm -hmm. running split close. Mm -hmm. When he used to put the double curls, because the split close has two running backs. He'd mm -hmm. run two option no. routes. If you man him up, they run out, mm -hmm. out routes, and you can't, you, can't, you can't guard that. If mm -hmm. you're running zone, they'd sit in the middle. They'd sit right in the zone, yeah. First down 10. Manu is blocking this blitz exceptionally well. He is literally blocking the blitz, doing everything perfect right now. Now he's sending the bit blitz, and he's picking it up with a motion. So that's, it's kind of taking away a receiving option. So uh, I, I look for, I mean, I would probably mix in a little bit of the fact, a little, little bit of uh, bluff defense maybe. Oh, play. No, I'm coveraging. Yeah, oh, I mean, yeah. Like, you, you know, you're, you're going to send out three people. I'm, I'm going to mix in a coverage and pretty on. He's part of me. Like Manu is playing really good now. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, he's made some couple of bad reads. He's punted twice. Mm -hmm. We have to remember, he's punted twice for his kid. He's down three points, and he can literally chew that if he wants to chew this whole clock out. Oh yeah, yeah. This this is this is the last drive of the game. Oh, excuse me, last drive of the half for me. Yeah, same here. Especially playing someone like Kev, I'm not getting it. It's either I finish, I, I kick it with no time on the clock, or I'm scoring with no time on the clock. I'm literally taking this to the end of the second. I have a two-minute warning, and that's what Manu's going to do. There we go. Um, updates on some games for you guys. I know Skimbo won earlier. I Skimbo won. What's, what's the lows? What's the lows? In, yeah, scheme uh, scheme and and can game. we get a scheme and low score? They were in that corner over there. I don't know if we can get an update from somebody. Hey, did Steve, hey goes. Did Stevie win? How are you guys a crew? You guys don't even watch each other. I know, I know, I know, but I know Larry has a hell game, but Stevie was over there down like 10. I thought one of y'all was going to go watch. 
Oh my god. Stevie was down 21 6 for anyone, Stevie J. I don't know if he finished that game. Though. Larry comes up with the clutch. Larry, how you feeling, Larry? Feeling. You got, wait, I didn't see it. What happened? All right, we're at two minute warning, second and four. Manu with the ball, down three. Um, I believe Manu got the ball first. So yeah. I think uh, Young Kiv gets the ball second half. Yeah, but he's literally blocking the blitz every time. Like, just yeah. make oh, a read, wow. man. Make a read, Manu. I mean, you are literally blocking the blitz. Yeah, he's blocking the blitz every time. Don't understand it. Like, you can sit in the pocket for an hour and a half. And he's not doing it because he's so because the blitz is so good and he, honestly it's because money. So I'm really. Scooby Jake is in Sir Tobin's head already, man. I already know it. Scooby Jake is hilarious. I think he's a top three captain. Oh, for okay. Sure. Okay. 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 So so what was your? Uh, we we got uh, my boy Coles. Oh my fault. Um. For, oh, he has B. Touchdown. I mean, if he makes the right move right here, he's not going to make it. But still, he's going to. And now, again, Kiv only has one timeout. Yeah. yeah. Manu has 10 yards. So he has a first down at 10. And he can still get a first down. Yeah. Exactly. So this is literally this is, the time where he just sees the clock. This is a 99.4% chance that it's probably going to be a run. The last drive, right? And I'm, I'm just running it three well, straight I'm, times. Yeah, this play is definitely. I'm just talking about this down right here. Is <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's for sure. Run, right. Pass right here. You're wild. <laughs> Anyone, you know what I mean? I don't care because you're, you're only I'm, down three. It's not I'm like you're rushing for seven. I'm in game eight right now. <laughs> I may run commit. Yeah, but we've seen what happens when I run commit. I just <laughs> ends up with a broom fatality. So we'll see. On that right it's side, a, and I know a point zero six percent chance he made it. Chat. He manned up that right side receiver. So new. You can tell by the way he's aligned right now. So if Manu has a dot to the corner now, if he's not running the ball, even though we all yeah. the whole stadium knew he was running the ball. Oh, yeah. And then Manu gets the perfect run. Yes, eight Second yards on a run. Yeah, yes, he's he's looking. He's actually looking to get a first down even before he scores. So Manu has gotten stopped twice and literally is playing this game perfect. Yeah. Still. I yeah. mean, like, yeah, he's made a couple of bad reads. He's, you know, he's been looking, struggling. But now he is. This is a perfect drive. Mm -hmm. Like textbook. Mm -hmm. You talk mm -hmm. about when people ask Madden players, you know, mm -hmm. clock management and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. This is a textbook drive. He, yeah. he literally is going to chew another 40. He can yeah. chew another and he 40 on top he, of that. He really doesn't want to break this four-yard run. No. He really wants that. I mean, he really no. wants this, this two-yard run, get the first down, and, or, and waste more clock. The perfect situation here is third in inches. Yeah. If he can get a third in inches, yeah. take the 40 off, it'll yeah. be 105. Yeah. You know, he gets the first down, 20 seconds left. 25 then, seconds, then, then you take your time. Exactly. So he still has three timeouts too, man. Manu in the perfect position. He gets seven right here. One Kev time, is definitely going to be feeling you know, so one time, uh -oh. So at this point, a lot of times when I, when I did play, sometimes I would I would give this touchdown up just so yeah. I can get the ball back. And my, and in this situation, if you're Manu, mm -hmm. you've already bad Kev up. You mm -hmm. feel like you have real good defense. Manu is known to be a really good defensive player. Mm -hmm. You're playing someone something that isn't anything special. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just bunch. Mm -hmm. Uh, so in this situation, when you're running with Mike Vick right there, I'm uh, not Mike Vick. I mean, he's looking like Mike Vick, you know. But if you're running with uh, Matt Ryan right there, are you going down? Are you going down at the one? Oh, oh, take a little are slide you, are you, there. Are you taking uh, the touch? Are you a mod Bradshaw in okay. it, or are you taking the touchdown? I, I think I'm running. Well, if I had the ball there, I'm definitely running the clock. Right? I'm not scoring right there. I'm not scoring. But if I'm Kiv, I think I let him score right there, oh, no, just so I, I can have the ball. If I'm Kiv, I 110 percent would have ran him it every play on that drive. Oh, okay. Pray he. Pray he throws a touchdown. Yeah, yeah. You know what so I mean. So Kiv's got the he's got the ball with a minute and thirty seven seconds. A lot of time to make a lot make plays downfield to at least get in field goal range right here. Exactly one thirty seven in Madden. He's got fifteen minutes and anything else. But Manu is literally playing a suffocate defense. Yes. Now, yes. now yes. we have to think deal. about it. Manu could be doing this in a great way. One thirty three left on the clock. Three timeouts. He still hasn't even had to call a timeout yet to stop the clock. Kiv is not going to run the ball because he wants to somehow get some points. He's down right now. Yeah. So Kiv literally is in a he's in an awful situation. Awful situation. Because if, if Manu keeps bagging him up like he is right now, oh, oh my God! You talk about absolutely, completely turn the monitor off. Stevie Wonder of the Year. That was a right at Deion Jones. But like I said. In the situation again, Kiv goes out of bounds. Mm -hmm. So he still has his three time Manu still has his three timeouts. Manu's been everywhere on defense. He's actually been all over this this formation this I'm game. I'm trying to tell you, man. Manu, one thing he's he's mixing, really mixing a lot of zone with man, he's mixing prepping, it up. You know what I mean? Oh, good time. Good time. Oh, good spin. Wow. He's in a bad situation. Here we go. Touchdown. Now he gets a seven back though. Yeah. Blind read. Y'all know what it is. 
pick, equal TD. That's how Madden go. Now he's been mixing a lot of man up. Every yeah. time he goes zone, it looks like it looks like Kim's dots that zone so fast. But with man, it's, it's a slower read and a little more rush. And so it's, it's, it was pretty. It was better than the zone defense that he's been running. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the man is definitely, especially the man with the linebacker. Mm -hmm. For some reason, the linebacker has been sticking everybody. Mm -hmm. Uh, he's been manning them up to a lot of different. You can see him sometimes. Those zone reads, Kiv's been, Kiv's been slicing those zone yeah. reads. Yeah, you got to go back to the man. You got to cross man like he was doing before and mm -hmm. make Kiv take that drag where he was having a little bit of space between the zone and the man mm -hmm. and then maybe hit for a hit stick. or maybe a, you, you, He should have stayed in the with, same defense. With the better players, I think it, it's, it's more or less before the pre-snap. You can't let a better player understand what you're in but before he snaps the ball because he's going to know exactly where to go. All the lab hours, you know exactly. If you're in a certain defense, try to mix it up a little man zone, a little zone man, different places. Kiv has definitely played. I mean, everyone's played this game for so long, mm -hmm. especially in bunch. Mm -hmm. Now, again, I mean, I'm, I, you know, in this situation, I'm watching this guy because he never, never, never X. What is it? Inside zone, run. Gain of four, second and six with a minute, 15 seconds left. Scuba Jake, all right, so I think I'm number one. Scuba's number two. Scuba's number two? And barely, or 1A, 1B, because Scuba really has me crying. Like, I really don't laugh at Madden tournaments like that. And this dude has me crying, so I, I think... I think Scoo is number two or one. One. Oh, oh my God. Oh, oh God. God. Why? Why? Okay. He's everyone. Yeah. He's everybody. And I, and and now now if you're Manu, you're back in the situation that Kid was in. If it's an incompletion, Kid gets a minute left. Yeah. So if you're Manu here, you still. So if you're Manu here, do you run the ball right here? No, Just I'm, I'm still okay. trying to die. Okay. Now, am I trying to go deep, take the top off? No. I would have some routes down here and look to dump down. Just like that. Make sure you get your ball in someone's hands. Mm -hmm. Because even if Manu doesn't get that first down, let's just say he hits a drag for two to three yards, mm -hmm. he's in a situation where he takes another 40 off the clock automatically and then he punts the ball and then kicks it out of bounds and then the kid has 13, 14 seconds to drive down the field. So, you know, he still has a chance, of course, like you said, he had a drag on the field right there. You know, if Kiv had covered the deep crosser, then he would have hit the drag, see if he could get the first. Yeah. So, I guess uh, we've got uh, second and four, 35 seconds. Clock running one timeout, almost in field goal range. Runs the ball to get in field goal range. I believe he's in field goal range right now. Yeah, so... And we're so, in the dome, no yep. wind, so easy. He's yeah, right. easy he's field goal out. right now. Middle hash mark right here. The question is, again, if you're Manu How aggressive are you right now? Yes, exactly. Are you aggressive? No. Okay. Manu has been playing smothering defense. Kid mm -hmm. is barely. Besides that streak on the right side of the field. Mm -hmm. So we're going... D. Jones loses uh, altercation. Barring a miracle, we're going him. in a halftime tied up. <laughs> he called him something that I can't say on screen. D. Jones said, why are you calling that? And uh, D. Jones. Thought, okay, he makes well. the kick. 10-10, tied up at halftime. This is a game you guys wanted to see. This is a game all you guys chimed in for. This is the game you got. 10-10 at halftime. See who pulls it out in the second half. Yeah. I mean... If you're Manu, you, like we said, he's been playing some other defense. Mm -hmm. Besides giving them that streak, mm -hmm. he literally hasn't had anything open on him. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, like he's driven down the field twice for sure. I'm not mm -hmm. saying Kiv hasn't been driving down the field officially, but Manu is making him work for everything, everything. except for everything. that. Except, except for that swipe that he exactly. went for. Yeah, that's exactly. A, yep. exactly. Except for that swipe he went for on the right. Hey, let's go. Get up. Right, right, right. 21. Young Kiv with the ball. Young Kiv has everyone open. He's going to get greedy for RB right there. And Manu really won that lurk. He was not fast enough. Either. Nah, nah, nah. I think he, he was on his linebacker, right? Yeah, he was okay, on uh, yeah. AKG. Or, I mean, the guy's name is uh, something that just isn't a lot. I can't say that. <laughs> so we're going to call him AKG. But again, again, Manu is definitely making him work for that read. He, he had to wait for that progression. Exactly. We're not. Manu is not giving up the flat. He's not giving up. That's the first thing. Yeah, exactly. Do not give that Do flat. Do not give that flat up. And you know they're gonna. We've seen too much of Skimbo mm -hmm. in championship games. He's not giving up that flat, flat, and he's not giving up that post right away. All right. So here we go. Uh, 
second down 11 right here. He gets yeah, stuck oh, he, on and the we talked it up. And we talked it up. And he hits the flat. <laughs> and he hits the flat. So now, but now he's in a great situation. Mm -hmm. See, mm -hmm. take letting someone get the flat on a, mm -hmm. on a uh, what a second uh, th second down 12 mm -hmm. is way better than him getting on a first down 10. Gotcha. Because now it's a third down seven. You're in a situation where he, I mean, I, defensively, I'm comfortable. This is, this is a pretty damn hard, you know. Uh, it looks like a third down. and four. I mean, fourth and four right now. He hits the Michael Jackson moonwalk. He didn't mean to press that. You know what I mean? He hits LB for no reason. Now he's in a So you like block. this stop right here or you, or, or, or you like this first down? I like, I like Marlon's stop. I'm biased, but he's going to play coverage. Oh. And he's going to square! And he steps out of the pocket. <laughs> Drifting back too much. Let's go! And you can see who Joe. Come on, boy! For. It's sweet! So Manu takes over, gets a stop coming out of halftime, takes over, tied up 10 10. He's going to run the inside zone. And Manu zone. is playing a perfect. I'm, I'm trying to tell you, except inside for those two zone. drives, Manu is playing a perfect game. Besides those two drives, he's getting screamed at. That's it. After that, Manu is playing a perfect game. Manu is playing a perfect game. Besides those two drives, yeah. he had to punt. And, yeah. and honestly, that's the perfect game because he punted both of those drives. You know what I mean? Like, punting. Isn't that bad? He didn't, what did he give up off the punt? Not nothing. Three? Yeah, yeah. That, it's not bad at all. But he's in a perfect situation right now. I mean, he's running all over this nigga three, three, five. Yeah. I mean, ten rushes, fifty-one yards. Play, 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 Who isn't play, taking play, play. five yards a, a pop? Who isn't taking five yards a pop? <laughs> <laughs> no, nobody in the United is taking five yards a pop. I don't think I ever pass the ball if I got five yards of carry. Yeah, I'm running every single. Yeah. I don't care if everyone knows. I don't care if you run, use the run commit. The run commit feature doesn't even work. So you want to run commit? I may mm. get a touchdown off it. Mm. So, I mean, I'm taking five yards all the time. So, if we see that motion coming again, it looks like he might be doing another inside zone if he stops that motion right there at the eye. And he's coming through. It looks like it's going to be a pass. pass yeah, if he, if he comes through, it looks like it's going to be a pass. Manu, Manu thinks he has something open. I think he has something open. He had a wide open touchdown. If Manu really wanted to. Okay. But, I mean, he didn't make the adjustment that I thought he was going to make. Now it, now, it looks like on the right side where the tight end is, it's a lot of open space over there. I don't, even, I don't, I don't, even, think, I don't even think Kiv is even playmaker over there. He had the streak for a touchdown yeah. on the right side of the field. Yeah. If he had motion, that guy in position. Mm -hmm. It's wide open. So, okay. Uh, you're playing good defense. Uh, tip picks are wild in this game. You know, are you going to force it? It does. He's going to take his three right here. Four for ten. I mean, he's playing... Right, he's played a, I don't know. The thing about, right, it's kind of, it's, it's, it's really hard to explain, right? Because Manu isn't playing a perfect game passing the ball, mm -hmm. but when he needs to convert, he has. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That's what I mean by perfect game. I don't mean like, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm cool with Manu, but I'm not going to see him be biased. He's throwing a bunch of blind reads to the left side, mm -hmm. you know, two, two out routes he thought could, you know? So Manu definitely has made some really bad reads. Mm -hmm. But he's playing when he needs to on those third or fourth down. He's, you know, he's, he's, play, he's playing in the situation. He's, yeah. playing, he's playing in the moment. And this is the moment. You don't, you don't get a round robin loss. This is the moment right now. You take a loss, you go home. And I don't think anyone wants to go home right now, so we're going to see what Young Kiv is going to do on this drive. Manu coming out in a 3-2-6. Young Kiv coming out again in the trips bunch. All right. And uh, second and two. You can't block that, bro. Head out, go. Head out, go. Jesus, second and two. Good dot by Kiv. Manu playing really good defense, though. Mm. And, I mean, it was literally right there. You give up the, the corner out that could have been a touchdown. Yeah. You the slant. Yeah. And you just make a tackle. Yeah, he, 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 he looked like he did not want to give that corner out up, so he just <laughs> no he what. got moving. Yeah, he got moving. And with these offenses, you really, I mean, you're not going to stop everything. You got to pick you pick your poison. Pick what you want to give up. Pick what you want to slow down. Exactly. And right now he's been slow. Okay, that time he... I think he had probably either a soft spot or just had a man up. Mm -hmm. just forgot that he didn't have a flat in the right side of the field. Uh, you know, it's another thing about being at home. Mm -hmm. uh, you can look at your adjustments. On that's, your that's, what I talked to, that's exactly what I talked to Cole about. <laughs> you can pull your play art and see, oh, I, I got him in a spy instead of having him in a flat. Exactly. So yeah. now Manu's in a situation where he doesn't know. And it hurts playing a good player like that. That's Manu, good defense. Oh, good defense. Oh, such a good oh, player. a dot by Kiv. Yes. Guys. Good patience by Kiv. Good he, patience if, by Kiv, yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. 
good patience because if he, he throws that early, he lurks that. Yeah, that was a – I mean, he was literally sitting there. We were just talking about how Martin didn't want to get at the corner. Mm -hmm. Martin saw it again. Mm -hmm. and, you know, gave up he, – he went to the slant this time mm -hmm. and gave him the great read. Devontae Freeman got his feet in the mountains. It was a good dive. Now he's got a little bit rush on this drive. He, the rush isn't bothering him at all. No. So that, that's that's pretty much the problem. The you can't cover time. everything. Yeah, exactly. This is the first time we've seen Manu has really. Oh, not gosh, too many people good get, run. Not too many people get pressure on bunch like you were saying. Mm -hmm. So Manu had been getting pressure fourth down. He's, mm -hmm. uh, he actually said three. Mm -hmm. Got to contain, you know, contain blitz off the left side of the field mm -hmm. right there. Like stuff like that is random. Mm -hmm. But when you're getting, it, you know, a bunch of those it, it looked like kid, it looked like kid had Kiv had happy feet on that too. He dropped out of that pocket a little too far, and that's when that, that rush came off the because side. It's because so many people with bunch mm -hmm. feet, like have never really been screamed at. Mm -hmm. Kiv has ran bunch for so many years now. You know, so many people that have ran bunch for so long. He goes at the Julio. Point. That oh. has to be a pick. I mean, can someone on the football field please just put their hands on the ball? Yeah, that's that's pretty much. I, mean, so I say I, about I say about seventy percent. That's pretty much an interception when so you get that count deflection. Him, every count of blind reads on both sides, like four four. I don't think that was a blind read. I think that was a blind prayer. <laughs> I think it was a blind I mean, read though. You have to understand that Manu has thrown some bad stuff to the court, to the out routes on the left side of the field. Mm -hmm. Definitely, you know, those were bad too. Mm -hmm. And look, we talked about the run out on the right side of the field. Like Manu's gonna play good run defense right bad here. That's been and now Manu has a game when he drives. Yeah. Yeah. It's gonna take he's gonna take the field goal. 13-13. So, I mean, again, four minutes. Manu having it in him to drive down the field. He's been converting when he needs to. Mm -hmm. But, again, I keep I keep stressing to you, chat, that a kid mans up that left side corner. And Manu keeps sitting that out while thinking it's going to be man. I've thrown that before. Kid's going to get a pick on that. Mm -hmm. If Manu doesn't wake up, kid's going to get a pick on that. Gotcha. Gotcha. So, I mean, I mean, luckily they can't. You know, I, w I wish they had So now at this point, at this point, is Kiv still bringing that consistent pressure? Or does he yes. mix it? Does he mix yes. it up when he brings that motion? See, personally, I would coverage, but Kiv yeah. is just going to a different. A different okay. Team. He joined the DB fire. Mm -hmm. This is in dollar now. Mm -hmm. He was just in nickel fifty five dollars. And uh, I mean, Manu is going this to run, literally this run, run all is, over. Oh, this. That if you might don't be score a right here. I mean, that God. might be a touchdown. I mean, if you don't score right that here, that might be a touchdown. Oh, like how? Goodness. How? It's a touchdown. There we go. Dudes don't have run stick, bro. Still, it's one on one, bro. Ron Parker don't got secure tackling. You better make that he's boy He's still miss. nice. He had the whole right side of the field. The whole nice left thirty side yard field. run right there. And I think that pretty much put him on a borderline for. Uh, oh, he's already in field goal. Yeah, he's in he's in field goal range right now. Right now, it's not even field. We're not talking about field possession right now. We're talking about the clock right now. We really don't. We're, we're in scoring range right yeah. now. So. Well, we're already in, like you said, we're yeah. already in scoring range. Yeah. As long as Manu doesn't take a you know, sack yeah. right here, or he doesn't do anything wild when it comes to like two first dropping back in the pocket and maybe you know not even know where he's going. Intentional mm -hmm. grounding, you know, mm -hmm. that's big this year too. So two first downs will wrap this game up. Yeah, run by Manu right there, bad gun stick, mm -hmm. cut that left. He had the whole wide open in the middle. And I mean, this is. So do you run uh, uh, getting a short gain on first down? Are you looking to run this down, or are you looking to try to get this first down through passing? Get up! Man 18, that's a touchdown. Man 19, it isn't. All right, so it's dub. We can get into a game right now. I'll run that a thousand times, and I'll be a thousand touchdowns. So are you looking at? Are you looking to run right here? Or are you looking to pass right here, second and one? <sighs> the only thing I'm scared about is getting hit in the backfield and not being able to kick that field goal. Okay. But with how like how weird the kick mark is this year. Oh my God. Oh, Th thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Stay in bounds. Thank you. There we go. We just we just play it smart. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. but now am I? The only reason why I'd be running the ball. Mm -hmm. Is because I want to get in the middle, just so I can kick the field goal down the middle. I know I'm bad with arms this year. That all uh, Madden nope. stuff definitely throws me off. You know, I'm a, I, I came in Madden 25 when the game was kind of watered down already compared to like where mm -hmm. it closed over beforehand. Mm -hmm. So I know that the arc, I can't kick without an arc right now. Gotcha. You know, I, I need to go into practice more, not having it. So if I'm running, I'm trying to run. I don't like his trips to the right right here, mm -hmm. like we were just talking about. Mm -hmm. I would be running trips to the left. Just, just, just to angle it up. But, but he still has two more downs. So, oh, that might. That's the game. That's the game. That's perfect wait, wait, right that there. Inches? Yes. Oh my that's perfect lord! Right there. You talk about a a prayer. I mean, we'll take it. Yeah. Yeah. You know, now question: uh, Are you are you keeping sneaking? You know, or what are you doing? Because you don't want to get this first. No, you're, you're sneaking. But you don't want to lose a yard. You're sneaking it, but you're, you, no way, no way you toss right here because you Excellent don't want to lose those yards. Second and inches. He's going to run a QB sneak. Mm. Yeah. Hey, hey, he's going to take it. He's going to take another time. So, so, 
I'm not quite sure. I'm not quite sure if I run. You got, you got the first thing. I'm not quite sure I run it out of shotgun right there. Just, just for something fluke. Guy comes through, hits me in the backfield. Now I'm looking at third and three. But it doesn't then, matter because he got the first thing. I feel like a lot of Madden players don't think about stuff like that. Like mm -hmm. the shotgun, you're starting five yards back. Three to five yards back. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. uh, you're, you're starting three to five yards back. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So like. All he has to do is shoot the gap, mm -hmm. and then he'll just mm -hmm. kill you. Yep. <laughs> and then you're in the backfield, yep. and what are you supposed to do? Yeah, I'm, I'm, maybe I'm a little conservative, but it definitely would have been it definitely would have been fullback dive or a QB sneak out of goal line. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I would have QB sneak the fullback dive too. Hopefully that I – maybe they stop me right, right there. You know, mm -hmm. inches again. Mm -hmm. I'm playing for inches again. Mm -hmm. I don't like this now, This, this but, confused me. That's fine. Yeah. At first, it, it confused you too. I don't like that call. I don't yeah. like that call. I don't like that call. You run it every single time here. I mean, it doesn't even make any because sense. Because what are you trying to get out of that? I don't even want to score that fast, so why would you pass it? I'm thinking maybe Manu was kind of worried about how we were just talking about. Like, remember that drive beforehand when Kiv was down. Or no, he wasn't down, but it was, what, 3-0? Mm -hmm. And when Manu just ran into the end zone. It's kind of like the same situation okay. where we... You're so thinking, are we going to run commit? You and me are going to run commit. We want this guy to – we want our drive back. So right here, I'm, I'm spreading the defense. You can walk in. You can handle it. I want my game running drive. Yeah, you can handle it. I'm not about to just sit here and try to lock this dude up. You had everybody open right there. Matt Ryan. Oh, I told man. people, Manu's Matt Ryan look like Mike Vick all the time. Touchdown. Nice pocket how. presence right there. And actually, actually, Kiv is, in, Kiv is in a good position. I mean, he's down seven, but at least he's getting the ball. At least he's getting the ball. I – with one timeout, he's got all day. It's up to him on this drive. Now he just needs to get, and he's been like you said. We've besides take that seven away that kid got off that spin. He's at six points all game, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and Manu punted twice this game. Mm -hmm. So I mean, defense is there, and he got. And the thing oh. is, he didn't get three. Oh, oh, he didn't get God, three. He missed that cut right there. He got seven. Mm -hmm. So this is a whole different pressure. This is a whole different pressure level. You get down to that 35 down three, you're like, damn, yeah. you know, like, I'm you know, cool. Thinking, thinking about it, just say young Kiv scores his touchdown. Are you thinking going for two or not? How much time is left? That's a good get, question, like, too. Is it, I guess, is it I guess over? It, is he going to get under, under 20 seconds. I'm just going to kick it. Okay. There we go. Let's have a comment again. And this, okay. is where, and this is where we got screwed up. <laughs> so at this this is the point where I think I think you're gonna see a lot of I think you're gonna see a lot of man on this drive. I'm letting he him sit work. in the pocket as much yes. as he wants and if he finds something. You can something, drag your life away. Exactly. Yeah. Because yeah. we're just gonna make the tackle. That's yeah. all I wanna do. I'm having at all times if I'm mine, I'm having two flats mm -hmm. and he doesn't have two flats because now he's going to try and that's an awful spin. Mm -hmm. Why not just run out of bounds and take your time? You're not gonna. Now he's to... mixing the zone up, but I, I, I mean, you could drag your life away and get to that red zone, and then you're gonna have to talk. Exactly. You know, I, I don't I would, care. I'm gonna let someone drag you to the 20. But yeah. What are you gonna do when you get inside that 20? Yeah. You know what I mean? When I can run a cover but two and not have to worry about no a deep bomb. There's no way I'm giving up that corner out. No way I'm giving up that post. And no way I'm giving up that that hook to the running back. Exactly. And he's gonna give up. He's going to I mean, up you the talk scene. About but I mean, that's. Again, is he going to get out of bounds right there? He holds RB so he doesn't fumble. Chad, if you guys didn't know that, if you hold RB with your quarterback, you're not going to fumble. So did he have that Did he have that streak up the seam open? It looked like he had a step on him. Really? Uh, yeah, X, right? Yeah, I was looking at it. Like you and me are both looking at it. I was like, I'm thinking, I'm not going to call touchdown because I don't know if, it, you know, if you're going to throw that like or not. It looked like he had a step on Verticals. Yeah. Oh. Very, that's, that's a very, 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 very big setup in the man community. Everyone likes to run that verticals. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, it's a very, very annoying play to stop. You have three quick reads. You're looking for the R1. You mm -hmm. want to take that away. And mm -hmm. then you're looking for the running back. Yeah. So he looks for the running back right there. And he's going to lose. So, second and ten. I mean, he's in the bunch like, again. Like no, are you sending the heat? I don't think he is. Yeah, I didn't think he was sending no heat at all. Coverage. Playing coverage this right here. This is literally the smartest defense. He sent his guy early, which means R1 is going to be open. Wow. I don't like that Can call. Hold on? I don't like on? that call. Uh. You were playing against Matt Ryan. You were playing against Matt Ryan. Mm. Why are you sending your man versus Matt Ryan? I would rather him run for yeah. It. yeah, it looks open, but yeah. Matt Ryan's not getting he's, yeah, that yeah. as he's just far as he time. just got right there. Yeah, he's not getting 30 yards. Ma Ma okay. And here we go. This is where. First and goal at the six yard line. Draw it got to get stingy. This is where it got to get stingy. So this, okay, this is, is this, this is three more. This is three straight passes. Yeah, you have yeah. to. Yeah. I, don't, I don't think I would have ran right there. And it's time to see if Julio can, can win you a tournament or win you a tournament game right here, man. Yeah. Or at least tie it back up, you know. So we'll read, see if Antonio. Read the, read the looking like. Chad, not going to lie. A drag to get open probably. If Julio doesn't score point. this game-winning touchdown, Antonio Brown's better than him in real life, and that's facts. That's awesome. 
Wow, wide open flat. Yeah. Wow. Did he get out of oh my gosh, and that two G didn't get out of bounds. It really doesn't matter. It doesn't he matter. He's still, he still got time oh, yeah, to get his two plays right. off. It doesn't matter. And let yeah. Hey, you talk about Wow. Die. 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 Wow. Shut up. Die. Die. Wow. Make me shut up. Wow. Make me shut up. Make me shut up. Young, Goofy. Young Kiv. Young Kiv. Let's. It was a dot, but make me shut up. Know he heard I'm still it. gonna be right here. <laughs> I'm still gonna be right here. It was a dot. It was a dot. It was a dot. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. You're goofy. You're goofy. You're goofy. You're goofy. I, I owe everybody. You sure about that? You sure about that? You sure about that? Cause I paid everybody. I paid everybody. You sure let's about go. that? Let's Shit, let's, it don't matter to me. We can step outside and finish this. Let's, let's go. We're gonna keep. Don't matter to me. We can step outside. This man shit ain't nothing to me. We're Promise gonna, you that. We're gonna Promise keep it the mad. Always good. Always good for you guys. <laughs> Give you guys something to listen to and watch. Thanks a lot, Joe. Thanks a lot for the commentating. Really appreciated your uh, input. Young kid with a dot. And young kid ties the game up. Seven seconds left right before. Looks like we're going into overtime, guys. Unless we see some real fluky right now. Sack on the play. Going to overtime. Young Kiv with a dot for the game tying touchdown. Great pass. Man, we got a lot of emotions in the building, guys. Let's see, let's keep it friendly, guys. Come on now. Okay, young kid on defense. Manu with the ball first. Manu coming out again and trips uh, tight end. Inside zone, up the middle, wide open for a seven-yard gain. Good run on first down. Second and second and three. Looks like Young Kibbs bring the heat on this play. Again, run up the middle. He's pretty much cashing him on this run. Young Kibbs got to settle down, play some good run D. Another run on first down, second and three. A little less than he normally gets on first down, so this is a good down right here. This is tell. Bringing the motion again. Nice dot to the running back. Oh, runs back. Loses about two yards on the play after the catch. Third and three. Not quite sure what, what he's looking for right here. Maybe. Maybe looking at a run again. Passes the ball. Throws it quick to the slant. Had somebody open over top of that first zone, but threw it early to the slant. Fourth and two. He's definitely going for it. This could be the game right here. This would be great field position if Young Kid gets the stop. Wow, wide open for the touchdown. Wow, dot for the cross. Young Kid, great game, Manu, great game. Two good competitors. You guys picked the hell game for the first game in the round, first uh, round game, and it definitely was a hell game. Overtime, Manu with the victory. Young Kiv played a great game. Somebody has to lose.